Hi there and welcome back, friends and snails, to the Seekers of Nautilon. Where we take on the whole galaxy now. Ah, well, the star axis of evil is against us. Led by the Salad Menace, the Vivisandia Star Confederacy, the second strongest... No, they have the strongest fleet. Computer says, but of course they don't have. We have the strongest fleet and we will prove that. And the whole galaxy, the whole galaxy, that attack of the evil star axis against the snails was met with unanimous support for the warriors of Nautilon, as you can see here. They give us everything. And we are fighting bravely against the invaders. <laughs> So foolish to attack the warriors of Nautilon. <laughs> and it's really hard for our big ships to to catch Corvettes. <laughs> like they're shooting everywhere except at the right thing. But we gained another level with Luke Snailwalker. Everything was nice. Um, one destroyer survived, so that was not so good, but... Other than that. <laughs> so our fleet is here. And now I believe we have time to upgrade a fleet, which is phenomenal. And we should, for that, look at the fleet manager. Uh, not the fleet manager, the, sh the ship designer. And look at our brave shells. Because we've gotten the dark matter reactor, the dark matter thrusters. Question is, should we go for different weapons? I don't think so, but... Um, let's just have a look. Accuracy 100%, tracking 60%. That's okay. Shield and armor penetration. Make for a weapon that is good against everyone. Here we have Advanced Combat Computer Swarm, that gives us evasion. That thing doesn't give us evasion. So evasion goes down by 1%. Now that's not much, we could change that and hit a little bit better with more tracking. Let's try that out. the brave shells and then we will upgrade that fleet it costs a little bit of something but it's gonna be good in no time yeah so there's that uh, we'll also need a little bit more alloys i believe because soon in inessa i think Hmm, not that soon, but... It's always helpful to have more coming, and even if we... Even if we only do that, and improve our matter decompressor, gain more minerals that way, even if we only go here to the asteroid frontier, and go for a completed ring world section, that would be nice, right? Even then it would be good. But I don't think we need the complete ring world section at the moment. I think we would rather have more resources incoming. So we'll look for that rather for now. It's an instant massive resources. So uh, where were we at? Waiting for the matter decompressor. Hmm. Well, that's over, right? <laughs> Once we've ordered all of that, and the Okla <coughs> opening borders again. Ah, status quo. The Haspalv. Oh, they're so pathetic now. And they don't awaken. For some reason. What happened here? Ooh. A move. Getting better. Taking uh, what we can. 
Let's check all the time what's moving where. Uh, all of these stellar clusters. We're awaiting them at our home. Uh, and that's pretty... Oh, look. We should repair these. Pretty wounded, got to say. 90% is not that good. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, let's let's upgrade rather. And where is our construction complete? Well, I don't know. In Nessa Habitat. Yeah, here we go. Just upgrade this already. Construction complete. 666. Construction um, complete. Minus two of a little Construction drop. complete. What? <laughs> Things are going odd. What's going on here? Let's give them some growth. I think we can afford also that. Poison mines. Yeah. Still something open. The Crimson Corporation. Ah, open the borders. Nice. And oh, here, yeah, lensing. Built on the existing gravity redirection system, the gravity lensing facility is able to redirect a portion of the force into a lens, concentrating the force even more strongly in a selected area. Very nice. We've got lensing. Next time would be boring. Go for the boring company or what? Mm, wanted this to be a trade station. We'll continue that path for now. Mm, I think we've gotten all the... Not all. Yeah, the, the planet exclusives. Usually very good. Trade districts. Already, yeah, we can replace them with habitation districts. Some of them at least. Construction complete. Oh, Celt Hunters are in combat. Ooh. We have mastered a new technology. Works is ready, yeah, it's ready. Got that, we've got this one. Let's see. Research Institute. I don't know if it's even good. I think it is though. Gives a lot. Morality support stuff, nice. And now we could go for army health, army damage, even more fleet command limit. Yeah, that's fleet command limit is pretty pretty nice. Xanid also opening borders. Very helpful. Hostile Xeno fleet detected. <gasps> Towards the Gemma system. Where's that? Here. Gemma system, they are moving that way, so they could reach the memories of the Membrex. Or where are they headed? They are headed down there. Down there. So they are aiming for Cold Circle. That's not good. What's going on here? 
Sutland's pilgrims emerging. Hmm. We need North Zealand's friends to move to the cold circle again. Construction complete. Yeah, we have the North East Three Fleet here. That's upgrading ships in the arc. That also look at that. Now they're uniting. Are they going into the same direction? I believe they are. Now it's getting a more little bit more dangerous. I mean we have Nautilus friends headed there. We should maybe also go for Sucklands Pilgrims. Still preparing for ship upgrades. Maybe that's not good. Mm. Commanding the Sarklands Crusaders. You should go here. And move to the cold circle instantly. Mm. That's Sarklands Crusaders. They can have... Miles for the fleet logistician. Hmm. Naughty three fleet needs to be upgraded to reach its full potential. Arc station is <laughs> doing tons of upgrades. Look at that. Shipyard is extra busy. Mm -hmm. Construction complete. Moving. Mm -hmm. Something coming in here. They are closing borders. Construction complete. Mm. There's that. A Salad Hunters are in combat. Tiny Jewel was ready now. Home of the Brave needs something. Yeah, the Salad Hunters. The Ark. Yeah, Nautilus friends are already moving. At record speed, of course. 10%, 30% more speed. Other ships are coming as well. Oh, that's maybe a little bit slow. Everyone will look here. Eighty-eight days, that's much better. Well, the Federation fleet is uh, preparing for the big conflict soon. Maybe we'll just then take all of this. In the future. Let's see if there's something moving in here as well. No, not right now. The human syndicate. Their gateway in the sun system. They're coming. Everyone's coming. Pilgrims as well. Well, this is the great buffer fleet of the Federation. Of course, always. Also, I mean, incredibly powerful. Here we go. Um, buy more of this. Now 
that could be a good good chance to eliminate a lot of fleets we could march into let's see about that but it's risky i mean they I, for all we know they could port in or something and there they are coming Probably upgrade this to a citadel as soon as we can. For now, we're not getting damaged. But that may change soon. Like now. Preparing to port, though. Here we go. Incoming! Construction complete. Save the station! Nautilus friends are ready. Charge! <laughs> oh, I think we got <laughs> we got a Titan there. <laughs> Inessa Habitat is ready. Well, that's big, right? Look at this. The mix taking everything down in a heartbeat. Wow. Yeah, well, I guess Nautilus friends are kind of good. <laughs> they fled. We've lost five defense platforms and one destroyer. They've lost some corvettes and stuff. Not important. Instantly at retreat, retreat, retreat. <laughs> Francine Drake won that. And mm, mm, we could upgrade to a citadel. Would that make sense? It would probably. So let's do that. And then we can also go for some more defense platforms. Could move in here and you can go back to upgrades. Construction complete. Northern's friends now. Nah. I believe I want them back to to the upgrading as well. Ah, we already have the precinct houses. Oh. Here we go. <sighs> Spiral skies. Yeah, we'll give them something to do. Well, that was quick enough. Construction complete. Are we ready here? Yeah, we are. Okay. No. We'll make that travel and then that. So on to Quib Duran. Nautilus Destiny is fine, is fine. Absolutely super fine. Here we could do something fancy, like the Military Academy plus the Stronghold. And then like have these, and this, and all kinds of things. <laughs> Construction complete. 
für uns claimen. Going on here, the Eureki. We have mastered a new nice. Matter compression, more armor hit points. We don't use armor much, but still. Um, kinetic weapons. Yeah, damage. Oh, yeah, attack speed. Let's go for attack speed. It's fine. Wait, I mean, we had that planet, right? The home of the world, the home of the brave. Food processing centers. Yeah, 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 yeah. And the exotic gas refineries. No, we don't want them. I want them to be demolished. It's a mining world. Still, it could be an agri world. As we need food more than minerals right now. Yeah, that's something interesting, right? Um, yeah, that's good. And he wanted fortress world. Hmm, generator districts. Food processing. It's a generator world, but we could... Sincerely... No, we need, we need more jobs on this. We cannot go and plaster everything with food. No, we need a temple in between. This, as an agri-world, functions very nicely. This is a rural world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rural research. That is... Hmm. I mean... There's a lot more farming going on, and we don't need mining right now, so... Make this an agri-world. Good day. We survived the attack. Bigger attack. Who knows where these fleets are now? Once we've arrived there. We can upgrade to nice things. Also, we can modify that. Get an even bigger corvette fleet. It's pretty fun to reinforce that fleet. Focusing arrays, energy weapon damage goes up. Mm. Well then, let's go to energy weapon attack speed. While we're at it. Dual Hive opens borders. Huh. There will be Sandhya. Laying claims. Well, we can make claims too, you know. Suter, wow. That's pretty expensive, but we want to get it. What's that? Is that... What is that? Is there a system hidden behind that system? That's, can you see that? That's so... Ah. Berzun, is there something behind that? <laughs> <laughs> 
Well, anyways, I'm gonna get Suta too. As soon to as possible. Construction complete. Inessa finished its queue. Hmm. Next round. Next round, yeah, I'm counting in rounds. It's not rounds. It's real time. Suter, here we go. Claim. Yeah, you have developed new weapons. I believe you have pistols now. And there are some, well, at least transport fleets. Not much more. Hmm. Construction complete. Cache of Nautilon. It's ready. Oddly, our strength seems to fall through these upgrades, but I cannot explain why. <laughs> Doesn't matter. The Pilgrim's fleet has been fully repaired and is now upgrading. Oh, the Senate Hunters are in combat again. Complete. Of course. <laughs> Everything will be taken down in an instant. And here we go. That was the instant. Our ships have been upgraded. Pretty nice, Nordi 3 fleet. Soon ready to strike again. The Ark Starbase, fine. go star hunters and that is a system where we can again take things so we will take things and quib the run Friends here. Origin system. What could we go for? Mm, pretty fine. We could upgrade a bit. Uh, it makes us faster, at least that, so. Let's start, you never know. Rus Iterum Ah oh, well, you know what, let's make a pause. Thank you for watching and happy gaming to you. We'll see each other in the next episode where this crazy war continues. Have a great time until then and happy gaming. This is Imam Rakan signing out. See you soon, my friends.